Right, over the next several videos, we're going to take a look at creating cinematic sequences using Unreal Matinee. As we go along, you're going to learn about working with cameras, about animating skeletal meshes, animating things like materials and lights, adding soundtracks, a lot of different things we're going to cover. But on top of that, I'm going to show you how you can add some extra kismet sequencing in the background to really take your, your feature, your cinematic film, and work that into gameplay so that it just kind of feels like one blends right into the other and that the player becomes part of that movie. Now let's give a quick demo of what we put together here. Now if we take a look here in the room, there's a little skeletal mesh of a robot. He's standing there with a link gun and not much else to do. If we fly back here to the back room, there's a little glowing blue switch, and that's all we have right now. So with that, I'm going to go ahead and fire the level up. The first time through, I'm going to be completely quiet, and you just take in everything that's there, okay? Did you see everything that happened there? Let's go through it one more time, and this time I'll point everything out to you. So let's jump back in. Notice that we've got some kind of nice ambient music playing in the background. Come around the corner, and when we hit the switch, the camera pulls back to show the light. We get some different music. Robot comes and threatens us. And we fly back to the player. Now the music changes again and we get into a firefight. Now currently, the sequence is in debug mode, meaning that we're actually reporting some information about this robot's health to the player right now. And if you notice, I can hit this guy as hard as I want to, and I'm never really gonna get him low enough to kill him. Basically, my, my gun just isn't strong enough. So if I go get the rocket launcher, long as I can score a direct hit, he's toast. So a lot of different things taking place, but as soon as he's dead, notice our original music fades back in. So there's a lot of different things we're going to cover. We'll walk you through the entire process of putting this sequence together step by step. I'm really excited to get started, so let's go ahead and get rolling. This section. 